how do you feel? This is our third night not sleeping with each other since we've been married. And that's because we both got separate work to do. Right, babe? Mm -hmm. I'm working on the business. You working on your personal stuff. So how do you feel that she haven't slept with me for three nights? Um, it, uh, I feel the same way I felt when we, we um, went celibate. Oh, okay. I know what you mean. Like when, we, when I moved out. That's how it feels. Yeah. Well, see you tomorrow. Okay. Love you. Love you too. Say bye to the vlog. Good night, you guys. Tell them how much you love them. They know I love them. All right. Bye. Peace. Peace. Hey, guys. So, right now it is currently, I think, like, 12 o'clock. I don't know the exact time, but we're working. Um, I just finished the sign for New York. Remember, in the last clip, I was telling you guys, um... I'm doing this like sign for the Bride of Christ New York. So here it is. I think it came out so cute. So I have to ship this out to New York tomorrow. Um, it says our our bridegroom is coming soon. Say hey, baby. I believe this is about wrong. One second, baby. Say hi to the world. So he's working right now. Um, this is for the Yeshua, the I am that I am shirt. We're in the guest room right now because this is just better for us. It's a mess. But these are all the t-shirts that we have so far. We're shipping about three, four shirts out tomorrow. Um, we also have some new colors. We have the blue, we have the coral, we have our orange. Got the machine over there. Spray paint from the board. And this is, we have to push the guest room bed all the way towards like the back. But um, this is our setup for now until God blesses us with something bigger and our own space. But I'm so excited. Are you morning, guys. Say good morning, babe. Morning. So it's really not morning, it's afternoon. It's 12 o'clock in the afternoon. Um, we have packages in the back. We have the flower sign that we're dropping off, so we're headed to you. Yes, and then after that we're gonna go to the mall because we just gotta pick up a few things before our trip. I have on my Gali apparel tee. He has on his I am the I am tee. So yeah. Those drop. They those doing very good. Uh huh. Okay. So we'll be back. Okay, guys. So we are in US. We are in. UPS and they talking about it is $331 to ship this box to New York. Yo, I'm about to just carry it on my flight at this point. <laughs> Yo, where he said $300? Yeah, hello? You, you can see me? Okay, guys. We're at USPS now in Palm City, Florida. Um, yeah, so we got UPS to package the box for us. We purchased the box and we paid for them to package everything. <laughs> we paid for them to package everything. So now we just have to, um, this is a big old box. This box is 33 by 741, whatever. So yeah. We gotta, we gotta send it up here. Yeah. So we're sending back a boohoo package that we purchased, and then these are our packages that we're sending out today. Okay, babe, it's done. In the mall. Say hey, babe. Okay. Well, we can't hear uh... To really look at sneakers, but we can look in Express. No, Express is always my store. They be having adhesives. So this is our fit. This is my fit. Shirt, 
Skyly Apparel Tee, of course. The back. Um, these jeans are from Pretty Little Thing. I have all my Yeezys. I don't even know what Yeezys these are. Cute little bag. Outfit is cute. Babe, show me your outfit. Yeshua, I am that I am shirt. Show the back. Yeah. Jeans and then show the feet, babe. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Whole fit, bitch. I'm the whole fit. Uh huh. Yep. So, yeah. <laughs> I like this shirt. I like the material. The motion. This is, <laughs> this is giving like a vacation vibe shirt. Super cute. Okay, baby. I like this shirt. And I like that shirt too. The back is fire. So it's currently five twenty three in the morning. We're still working. You got some shirts done. You got the Son of a Royal Priesthood shirt. All of these are done. These are going to the conference. Babe is weeding and cutting. We're listening to a sermon. We still have all of these shirts left, but we're making progress. These shirts are being shipped out, and some of them are going to the Bahamas. And yeah. How do you feel, babe? Talk to the camera. You haven't said much. I'm grinding. What else? Grinding. We are grinding for y'all. We love you all. So we are at the post office. Baby's going to drop off a package. Yes, so. Just dropped off his goods. Stay in Michael's. Come here to get some more vinyl. So we just finished up some shirts. It is 8.25. And apparently I have to go work out. Is that true? Mm-hmm. So I guess we have to go work. What are we doing? Not the body. How are we doing upper body? Don't worry about it. <laughs> Where are we working out? In the garage. Let me get you together. Let's get it. We're about to go work out and then we're gonna come back and try to pack, right? Mm -hmm. You start with seven push-ups, seven lateral raises, seven front, seven up right row. Then you're gonna get on the ground. You're gonna do um, dumbbell bench press. <laughs> <laughs> Seven each one, and then you're gonna get up and finish with curl. That's one set. Let's get it. So, first of all, I can't even. I can't even. You're not even. She's not I trying. I am. I cannot do that. You're not trying. Yes, I am trying. You, she don't want y'all to see that she's crying. I cannot do that. There you go. I did not sign up for this. Huh? 
I'm not doing burpees. <laughs> I'm not doing burpees. Babe, no. looking happy that he could just torture me good morning guys it is currently 10 37 i'm at the post office about to drop off a few packages so yeah i'm gonna be vlogging today um yeah i'm gonna be vlogging today because i'm getting my hair done and i'm doing some trip prep as you guys know we're leaving to new york tomorrow so babe is currently not with me right now um he's in broward handling his stuff so he's gonna be vlogging his portion and i'm gonna combine the vlogs together um and he's on the phone right now just being so loud i guess he's making him some breakfast but yeah we're at the post office gonna go ahead and drop off these packages and i will see you guys in the next clip um Hey guys, this is my new hair color. Um, I'm gonna be going a little bit lighter. I'm gonna do some blonde highlights, but I love it. Lee hasn't seen yet. What do you think Lee's gonna say? <laughs> wow. I think so too. And this is also my first time getting beach wave. I don't even know how to maintain this. But beach wave. This yeah. is the beach wave. Oh, how do you maintain it? Did you? I don't know. I don't know. Let's go. This. So, hey, babe. Well, good. So it's 8.52, um, I'm in Broward right now. It is raining really badly, but we're on the way to get our toiletries because in the last clip, I told y'all I was going to Walmart and I told y'all I was going to all these places, but apparently I didn't time myself appropriately, so I didn't get to go to Walmart. So now we're doing our last minute shopping right now. We just gotta get like little essentials like soap, toothpaste. Um, I gotta get some stuff for my hair and possibly some sweatpants for tomorrow. And babe, is there anything that you need specifically? Just so? Probably more deodorant. And deodorant and stuff like that. So, this is your first, this is you guys' first time seeing babe. How you feel about that, babe? How do you like my hair? Beautiful. Yeah, so basically, Target. Getting some um, toiletries. I'm gonna put this right here. Oh, I need to get some more of the, um, soap. You know what I'm saying? No, it smells good. You guys, if you guys don't know about the EOS, y'all need to get y'all some. Should I get a pack of wipes, babe? Flushable wipes. Um, yeah. So that's what we're doing right now. Getting our toiletries. So guys, we're weighing our bag. And literally, how much is it, babe? Make it show again. How do we make it? Oh, it's literally, hold on, because I think it's at 40. Babe, it's all 41. Uh oh. That part. <laughs> yeah, so we gotta take some stuff out. Hey guys, so we made it to New York. Yeah, we're trying to light this on camera. It's currently 11 43. Our flight landed at 11. Um, we have to pick up our bags. 
so we have our bags we had to take the shuttle the six shuttle to six in order for us to um, get the car that we rented also my dad is meeting us we're gonna go out and eat with him eat some breakfast with him um this is his first time meeting lee how do you feel lee yeah they've never met before and my dad also doesn't know that we're married but he's gonna find out today we got up at what four we ain't go to sleep till like two um it took us forever to um figure out the uh packing situation uh, we was overweight with the luggage quite a few times um and miss queen packer here was the leader of that um, every time i tried to assist um, she said be quiet and let me pack um am i right no uh, but yeah we're picking up the rental now and then we're going to eat we'll catch you up later when, when i meet her dad uh, we'll probably set up a seat camera somewhere we will not set up a seat camera <laughs> I just wanted to show you guys my nails. Like, get into it, baby. Super cute. Look how pretty his eyes are. Come, show them your eyes. Look into the camera. Don't blink, don't blink. Look into the camera, babe. His eyes are super duper pretty. He has such thick eyebrows and nice eyelashes. I think these are a D curl, 15 millimeter. You think what? <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel driving in New York, babe? Yeah. The roads uh, <laughs> don't make sense. My mom is back there being a backseat princess. Yeah, she's been baby this whole trip and we just got here. <laughs> Guys, don't mind my rollers. But these are the earrings. Earrings are from Express, super cute, super dainty. Obviously my ring, gold jewelry gold jewelry super cute nails just giving um bodysuit jumpsuit is from target bag is louis sneakers are easy because babe's outfit got the godly apparel on her okay guys babe share outfit options i need help so these turn around babe no watch huh turn around babe where to watch Yes. This. So this one. Sister. Hi. Uh, ooh, this one. Those are cute. Or this one. What's the outfit? This. Okay. Hmm. Well, my bag's got sil silver. Let me see the I bag. I think these. Let me see the bag, though. Yeah, get the bag. Get the whole outfit together. This is Dev's outfit. This is the outfit. Cute, cute. Rosina. So, I think these. Those. Yes. I think those. Yeah. Mom? Look, not you posing, waiting. <laughs> she was standing there posing. Yeah. Okay, shirt from Express. Bag is Gucci. Um, jeans are what, Mom? Target? Express. Express. Okay, sandals. Old Navy. Old Navy. Super cute. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, it's hot weather all the time. I like that. God, you call me by my name. The love you give me, I just can't deny. Yeah. No longer blinded, I can see Oh, gosh. What's up, y'all? Getting ready for bed. 
I'm getting ready for the next day. Um, I'm rolling up my hair right now. Bae's tired. He's been driving all day, but we're getting prepared for tomorrow. So we'll record our process of us getting ready for the conference. And we'll show you guys the conference tomorrow. Her process is going to be long, of course. Yeah, his process is going to be five minutes. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. So this is the fit for me. Thanks for it. If you think the white, I should wear the white shirt. Why can you waste it? They said my time's wasted if I chase in the cash. I said the first gonna be last. You know the, you got everything you need right now. Card up in your presence. God, I just wanna sit here at your feet. I'm caught up in
Y'all boy, we in New York, New York, New York. Boy, that burger look good, boy. Hey, all these tiny ribbons. Check the fit ski. Litsky. Check the fit ski. It was a. Okay, guys, so we got the oxtail with cabbage, rice and peas. Already, this rice and peas is not given Caribbean, Jamaican, so they've got plantain and the same thing. How's it, baby? What'd you eat? The present? How's the present? Good? Okay. Obviously, Canada Dry and Coke. Deb, Charmaine, Rosina, Alexis, London. Let me see the back. It's a video. <laughs> chapter 1. Okay? It says, in the beginning, God created what? <laughs> so, in the beginning, God created the spiritual realm and the natural realm. The heaven and the earth. The earth is the natural realm. We operate here in the natural realm. So, with my natural eyes, I can see what we call sight. So, in other words, we walk by what? Faith. So, sight is external. Faith is internal. Without man, God will not. Without God, man cannot. So God said, I'm going to use you to bring heaven to earth, to the scene. Everyone got that, right? Let's proceed. So God gave Adam, in the Bible, the Bible, the word of God, used a lot of symbolisms, right? So that we can understand the spiritual, because our earthly mind, because of this vessel, the mind is a vessel. This vessel cannot understand spiritual things because this vessel was only created to operate where? Here, in the earthly realm. So that's why the Bible says in uh, 2 Corinthians chapter 2, around 14, 15, 16, the natural man cannot understand the things of the spirit. They're what? Spiritually discerned. What does Adam mean here, okay? So Adam, we said, here is what we get in here, okay? Adam was symbolic of the heart. Your spirit being. God is a spirit. He only deals with the spirit. Okay? Eve was symbolic of your what? Mind. How many senses do we have? Five. Okay, go back and read. Sometimes you don't want to go back and read. Go right back in Genesis chapter 3. You'll see that the serpent, he dealt with all of Eve's senses. All of them. She was talking to the servant, so that's going to be what's called about. She what? Yeah. Hearing. Communication yeah. hearing. What else did she do? What other sense? She, she saw. She saw the fruit, so that's going to be sight. Okay. What else? She touched, she touched it. it. That's three of them. So fourth, what did she do? Smell. That's fourth. Got one more. What is that? Smell. When you eat something, you automatically what? Smell. And that would all fall. Because all five of your senses are attached to your what? You go touch the fire. You go touch the mind. Will tell the hand that is what. 
when we deal with all the senses, even when we look at uh, Matthew chapter 4, when Jesus was tempted, the devil wanted Jesus to operate in what realm? The natural. So now, how do we know that? Turn these stones into what? Bread. Jesus said, man does not live. But every word. The word is what? Spiritual. The spiritual. Man should live by, should not live by bread alone, but every word that proceeded out of the mouth of God. So God is a spirit, so he deals with us with our spirit man, our heart. God only deals with my heart. Because my mind cannot compromise. So these are vessels. What are vessels? I'm gonna give you an example of vessels of this. Cause you call me by my name The love you give me I just can't deny Yeah No longer blinded I can see you I'm on my way to Say Father God refine me Speak to me right now God I want you to do this process this question I think that you give me power to endure Trials and tribulations already inside of me Mercy. Make me into a vessel. Make me into a vessel. The way that you see fit. The way that you see fit. According to your time. According to your time. So that I am. So that I am. Made into a vessel. Made into a vessel. Of honor. Of honor. The way that you see fit. The way that you see fit. I should not speak to the potter. I should not speak to the potter. And complain. And complain. Or murmur. Or murmur. Because you know. Because you know the end before the beginning. The end before the beginning. And I say yes. And I say yes. To King Jesus. In Jesus Christ my name. Amen. So intimate, intimate to me right here, right now, you all. Hey guys. Hey everybody. We're back from the conference. Today was the last day of the Brooklyn, New York conference. Today was so beautiful. The Holy Spirit was definitely moving. My voice is gone. Um, there was definitely some gifts birthed out. I'm so happy. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Um, yeah, tell them about your experience, baby. Um, I think it was a beautiful experience. Uh, when we prayed about if we should go, God said yes, obviously, since we came. Uh, we was like, uh, we wondered what he had in store for us. And I know me personally, I shared this with her. I think it was to to serve and to pour into people. Um, it was a few people that he put. Uh, he placed some messages and some things on my heart uh, for them to for me to share with them, and it was just confirmation for them and what they needed. So it was just so beautiful um, that we were just you know willing vessels and living sacrifices, Amen. and it's our obedience. Um, that you know answer people prayers that's why they say obedience is better than sacrifice, sacrifice. and it was a few of them um that i could remember god downloaded me to say them is what they needed confirmation basically. it's confirmation um i also just want to add that we are saved to serve so it's a pleasure to serve the last conference in um atlanta i feel like we received because you know you got engaged like we were getting a lot of words from people and now this conference is like completely different we're on their serving side so mm -hmm. even though every single conference we serve at you know um, we help to set up we help to clean up we even like sell he was selling his t-shirts i was selling my books and we're so appreciative for our pastors for allowing us for like you know allowing us to be on this platform so we can sell to you guys and um just you know help us birth out the gifts and the seeds that god has placed on the inside of us you know creativity writing we both have that gift and also um yeah we're definitely safe to serve so it was just a pleasure letting the holy spirit use us today we made sure um that when we came here we knew that we weren't going to conform to the temperature we were going to set the temperature and i believe we definitely came here and planted a seed in brooklyn new york um you know to help save souls and just draw more people to the kingdom um, there was so much truth being spoken today. There was not a sugar-coated message today or yesterday. So I just encourage you guys, come on to our Bible studies, um, Rest Ministries. We'll also leave the link inside of our bio because it has truly been life-changing. Mm -hmm. um, I can't wait until Houston. Yeah, we're going to be in Houston in November. So Also, um, for everyone that um, purchased a shirt or a book, uh, we thank you. Um, we really appreciate the support. 
um, praying for you guys. Pray that it serves well. Pray that the message uh, on the shirts or whether the scripture that you read that it really feeds you, like I like we know it will because it, it came from God. And saves a soul as well. So we just love and we just appreciate you guys. Um, this is our first time vlogging together, so hopefully these clips are good enough. And hopefully you guys enjoy this vlog. I don't believe this is the end of the vlog because we might do something tonight. We really came to to serve, and we're just do God's right. We're blessed to be able to serve. Um, we we we're blessed. God used us to pour into some um, plant some seeds into some individual lives. Um, but if you're watching this video, we love you guys. We're so thankful for you guys. Um, follow uh, Godly Apparel, Godly Apparel on. Um, Instagram L-E-E -E, not L Y. Um right, once again, thank you to Pastor Glad, Pastor Jason, uh, for everything. Um, yeah. from sell allowing us to sell our shirts there and books there to just pouring in us to so constantly being our spiritual parents. Being our spiritual parents, just thank you so much. Um we really appreciate you guys and we love you dearly. We love you guys so much. Cause Jesus, you don't hold me. It's more than anything that you can do God, I just want you Well, I'm sorry When I've just gone through the most What time is it, baby? About five It's five o'clock, we're at the airport We were at 5.15 We've been up for what, how many hours? We've been up since Almost what? 24 hours Almost 6 o'clock will make it 24 hours Ain't y'all woke up early praying and stuff? Mm-hmm I'm tired This is Spirit's line I will never fly Spirit again He's here, he's in a Camry. We're finally in Florida. How do you feel, babe? How do you feel? I feel good, I'm success. It's so tired. travels. It's 9-11. We were, we stayed up for 24 hours. We only had two hours, what, two hours of sleep, three hours of sleep in the last 26, 29 hours. Yeah, we've been doing the Lord's work. But, uh, yeah, that's the end of our New York trip. We will probably recap once we get home. But, uh, love you guys. Bye. What's going on, everybody? Uh, just want to catch you all up with how the meeting went with uh, Ray Dab. Um, we met at IHOP. Uh, going into, I didn't really, I didn't really expect uh, any uh, anything for real. Um, wasn't scared. Was no anxiety or anything because it was well, <laughs> it was long overdue, man. But um, yeah, it went good, man. He's he's a good guy. He's a he was um a, a cool dude, man. It was kind of awesome to meet someone who helped uh, the parent of who helped bring this beautiful woman to the to this uh, world um, that I call my wife. Um, but Ray, how you thought it went? Good. Just good. Yo, she just thought it went just good too. Um, <laughs> But now it was awesome. Uh, just want to catch you all up with everything, give you all a quick uh, recap of that. But we love you guys. Okay, guys, so we are at Restoration Hardware. It's very dark in here. How you doing? Thank you. They brought us some Two, two, two buns. Here you come. You won't be able to see it really. But.
Since we've been married, how do you feel, babe? I feel good. It's a beautiful feeling. I feel great too. It's been such a good experience. These past two months have flown by. We've been traveling, we've been doing the Lord's work, and we've just been enjoying each other's presence. I love you so much. I love you more. Can't wait to do forever with you. But um, this is the end of this vlog. We have so many clips in here for you guys, all the way from us preparing for the Bride of Christ tour in New York and, and just what our day to day life looks like. Um, so, yeah, we enjoyed dinner tonight. We're going to be coming back with another vlog um, pretty soon, hopefully. We'll be preparing for Houston very soon. We already got our tickets yesterday. Um, so, yeah, we'll be preparing for Houston and yeah we'll be doing more vlogs i think we're gonna do like separate segments like i do stuff separately from him like tomorrow i'm going to a women's event so i want to record that and um we're gonna have him record what his day looks like maybe tomorrow or throughout the week so you guys can get both of our perspectives of the day in our life but we love you guys so much peace love thank you guys. guys for subscribing <clears throat> stay tuned because we have so much more in store and we'll see you in the next vlog Love you guys. You better else. Jesus love you, God do too. Let come on, I'm trying to tell you. Repeat it, turn me your wig away, I'm trying to tell you. That's more, that's more. Leave, love, leave, love, leave, love. Give me different designer. Talking that shit, 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 talking that sh